Good evening, teacups. All right, I'm still working on my another um pot of dandelion dandelion root tea. I hope it's not backwards. It looks like it's backwards. Um, but I'm glad to see you, teacups. And um, I just want to talk about the the stimulus, um, the che the proposal, and the the checks that everybody's talking about. <laughs> um, I believe, and this is just my opinion. Everybody's entitled to their own opinion, but I believe that these checks. Are not enough okay it's people that are not working and they're waiting on unemployment and I don't the unemployment is like taking this time with the checks or they just got a backlog or something some they don't have enough people working for them <laughs> something is happening with the unemployment people are still waiting on their first stimulus check you know and I just think that that proposal, I don't remember the name of it, but it was $2,000 and it would be um, prorated from March, okay? $2,000 per month per person in the household, even if your children are claimed on your taxes, even if they're in college, everybody in the household gets $2,000 per month. And this particular one. It was several of them that was $2,000. Um, but this particular one was $2,000 per month all the way up through a year after the virus is um, said to be gone. Okay. That's the one that we need. <laughs> and I'm not trying to depend on the government or anything. I mean, but if they want people to if they want this virus to go, they need to see what other countries did. They took care of their people and they stayed home. They were able to stay home because, and they didn't complain. They didn't have um, all these protests about going back to work because they were being taken care of. Um, I just, I don't know. I'm not going to talk about our president, but... <laughs> It's some things that he says that are not right, and he cannot be a godly person. <laughs> he says he's a Christian, but he cannot have a, a relationship with God. Acting the way that he does and just flat out, just the way that he is, it just bothers me, y'all. If you're an, a, a, a supporter of Trump, then just please forgive me. I'm entitled to my opinion, okay? Um. So as far as the stimulus, the, st the second one, you know, this is the one that was um, voted on in the House and it was approved, but it still has to go to the Senate. OK, this is the twelve hundred dollar one, just like the last one we got. And I'm sure that it helped. But some people's mortgage is way above twelve hundred dollars. But I guess, you know, we're not supposed to use it for mortgage or rent or whatever. We're just supposed to use it for essentials. So, um, 
So it was voted on in the House and it was approved. Um, and just like the first round of payments by Congress in March, um, this proposal, um, the $1,200 to those earning up to $75,000 a year and $2,400 um, per month to couples without dependents, making double that before phasing out. Um, but it's, but this one is, you know, like I said, the dependents will be receiving $1,200 also. Um, so that is a plus. Okay. Um, and I think that some of the um, college loans will be you'll be able to, like, they can't make you pay for them. <laughs> so that is, like, to me, that's, like, the wealth of the wicked being transferred to the righteous. So we'll see what happens. Um, It still has to go to the Senate, like I said. The Senate has to vote on it, and if they approve it, which they are probably, probably going to want negotiations, but if they do approve it, then it will um, go to the president's desk in the Oval Office, okay? If he approves it, then it can, we could get it. If not, if he vetoes it, then it has to go all the way back to the House and start all over because they have to negotiate. Um, that's just the bottom line. They have to negotiate, so... I uh, just wanted to speak on that, give you a little update, because the last time I did a stimulus um, check video, it was just being proposed, and it was different proposals. But this time, they decided to, the, on the $1,200 one, the House did. So, it's not over yet, and I mean, we might not see anything if it's approved until like late June, July or something like that. So make sure you're saving your money. Don't spend frivolously. Um, only get the things that you need. Food, you know, essentials. And if you can find toilet paper. <laughs> Because people have gone crazy over the toilet paper. And I really don't understand because it's not like we can't go to the store. You know, I can understand if we were like just shut down and we couldn't leave the house, you know, to get groceries or, you know, things that we need. Leave some of the stuff on the shelf so, so other people can get some, okay? Now, if you didn't know, now you know, okay? All right, blessings to you all, teacups. And I'll be praying for you. Bye. Would you like some coffee? Would you like some tea?